meme review ladies and gentlemen hello my name is parker welcome back to once again to another episode of call of duty mobile memes this is episode four and it's a special episode for two reasons not only is it christmas and i hope you guys are enjoying your christmas by the way but it is also a 200 thousand subscribers special so thank you guys so much for 200,000 subs we actually just hit that a couple days ago so i appreciate that greatly and also once again merry christmas this episode should be a lot of fun if you guys are new to this whole series pretty much i just go and react to some juicy call of duty mobile memes out there now on the last video i asked for 2500 likes and you guys just absolutely crushed it so if you guys want episode five of call of duty mobile memes you have to go and hit 3,000 likes on this video this is my biggest delight goal of all time and if we're able to go and hit it then episode 5 will be a thing but without further ado we might as well hop right into the memes all right first meme me trying to use the msmc okay and then we'll play the video here and then oh my god what <laughs> okay you know what i can actually relate to this i don't know if it's just me but i cannot control the msmc's recoil to go and save my life and i've recently been using weapons with high recoil like the type 25 but dude i just feel like when it comes to the msmc it is a completely different beast and i feel like in order if you want to be good with this weapon you have to be like one of those high tier players like a high master or even a legendary player to go and use it properly but at least for me anyways i cannot use it to save my life here call of duty crates be like cool character cool weapon skin cool, cool weapon skins and then it credits always at the bottom here but yeah obviously this uh little thing that they have going on this contraption it just always goes for credits and i feel like you could also probably have in the credit spots just the weapon xp cards as well because i feel like that's all i get primarily from the crates man it's just oh yeah you want credits and it's not even like the higher tier credits because i know in some crates you can get up to 500 credits no it's always the 100 the 200 credits and it's like okay gg time it takes for one rotation okay 24 hours for the earth 1408 hours 5832 hours and then Oh god, what is this? Oh, okay. One billion hours, and that's just for the COD <laughs> credit store here. You know, I actually like this, and I feel like it's so true, man. I feel like they never go and change up the credit store. Like, when it comes to the COD point store, oh yeah, new stuff every single week. I hope you guys all enjoy this, but hey, don't remember, you have to spend 200 plus dollars if you want the certain rarity item that they might have in those crates, but yeah, it's a, it's a sad moment for all the free-to-play people out there because, dude, the credit store, it is so lame. All the items within that credit store are probably going to be completely bogus. When your character says, enemy spotted, but you, <laughs> but you literally can't see anyone. The juicy SpongeBob <laughs> memes. Dude, it's, the SpongeBob memes are always the greatest. I love this so much. How it feels playing it with the jade skin. <laughs> okay, and dude, I feel like you can also also say this with the new santa skin that they just added into this game as well but i feel like at least for me when i use the jade skin in the battle royale it kind of helps because when i go and play the battle royale for this game i just try to go for the most amount of kills possible and i feel like the more poppy your skin is or just the more vibrant it is the more people will kind of be attracted to you and that's kind of what i want like granted in multiplayer it's probably not the you know highest iq play to go and run with a skin like that useless things in the world okay there's like a coffee mug with the handle inside there's a fence just blocking off a sidewalk there is i'm forgetting what that's called but it's just like going right back into the water jug itself and then okay dude you know what i want cod mobile to start implementing this like i have so many amazing ideas and then for you guys that don't know this is the header the backpack the clothing and then the suit itself yeah for the most part they haven't been doing a good job at even including big quality items within this like the headgear dude i would love for there to be like a snowman headgear like you can just go and have a snowman helmet on which i feel like would be so amazing 
thing. But yeah, they definitely have to do a better job at, you know, spicing some things up when it comes to that selection. When a random in Battle Royale crosses the entire map with a chopper, kills off the entire enemy squad, picks up your dog tag at the last moment <laughs> and revives you 10 seconds before the final revive flight. Just a true American hero who, who goes and does this stuff. And hey, I gotta say, for everyone who plays the Battle Royale and you're hopping into a random squad with other guys, Please don't be that guy that just goes and abandons your team. I feel like the biggest thing, at least for me when it comes to squads, is just teamwork. You know, you have to go and get your buddy's dog tag. And I feel so, like, at least for me, when I go and play, and I try my best to go and get my teammate's dog tag, but somehow, you know, I was just caught up in going and killing other people and I wasn't able to go and get it in time. I just feel so guilty. And it's the kind of the same thing when it came to zombies on the counter. Council, Call of Duty Zombies on the Council there, in which if you let someone go and bleed out, you know, all they have is just them spectating you in the main lobby. They're going to go and lose all their weapons. So I even feel guilty from that aspect as well. When your team loses, but you get the most kills out of everyone in the match. Yeah, the, the gold trash. Let's go. Hey, e even though we're trash. We're gold trash, ladies and gentlemen. Remember him, okay? And then it's uh, a cute baby Groot here. And then this is him now. Yeah, okay. Then we have... I do, I'm forgetting what this guy's name is. It starts with a J. It's just some weird, wacky boss name. But yeah, baby Groot, he's, he's all grown up, ladies and gentlemen. Just look at him now. It's been abandoned for a long time. Data indicates this area's house is a secret research facility <laughs> from World War II. Shut the F up. Please shut the F up. Dude, it's so funny. When I went and recorded some of the most recent zombie videos that I did, I would always have to wait for this line of dialogue just to get done before I could go and like do an introduction to the video. Because every single time, it's always that voice line that you hear in the beginning of the game. I'm bored at my office, so I photoshopped this. And oh my god, the Avengers Soldier Crate. So this isn't really a meme per se, but it's just, oh my god. Dude, how awesome would this be if there ever is a situation in which there's like COD Mobile X Avengers and we get to go and unlock skins like this? Like, yeah, dude, I don't know if you guys are looking at the COD points, by the way. In order to go and buy one of these crates, it's 800 which is $10, which isn't really that bad, I guess. But, you know, your chances of going and getting someone like Thanos, for example, COD Mobile's probably going to be like, oh yeah, let's make Thanos be a 0.001% chance. Yeah, okay, GG, COD Mobile. Ew, I stepped in uh, uh, fecal matter, and then <laughs> it is gravity splash. Dude, it's so funny. I'm forgetting when this was. I think this was on Twitter, but um, I know Jokesta, he replied because COD Mobile went and made like a promotional tweet saying the gravity spikes are now available in COD Mobile and Jokesta was just straight up honest with them by being like, dude, I'm not going to lie with you guys. The gravity spikes, they suck. And the COD Mobile was like, okay, how can we go and make the gravity spikes better? And dude, for me personally, I would like to have maybe the gravity spikes have a faster recharge time or at least get to have I don't know two or three slams with each recharge your teammates after reaching level 15 in zombies <laughs> survival mode I, I'm gonna head out and then we got Spongebob dude the Spongebob beams are always juicy but I feel like why people go and do this is because I'm pretty sure after level 15, that's when you can go and unlock the either the Dempsey or the specialty pistol that you can go and get from the shard. So yeah, people aren't really willing to go and play what the two hours and 40 minutes that you have in order to go get to the very end of survival. Nah, nah they just want that Dempsey skin. Tencent gives players a cool sniper rifle and then the community. What a surprise, but what? Pikachu, what is going on here? Go, wait, are you hold up? You're telling me that Tencent is giving us an item for free? 
And okay, I feel like I just sound like such a hater right now. Like, dude, I feel like it is cool that they're giving us stuff. And like, for example, I know with the Christmas time here, they actually gave out some pretty cool, like themed Christmas weapons, which is so much cooler than, you know, this in quotes, cool sniper rifle. The, the Deep Shark DLQ 33, maybe it's just me. I'm not a really big fan of that camo, but when it comes to a lot of the, the newer Christmas free weapons that we got, I'm actually kind of a big fan of those 10 cents next to crate and oh, wait hold up is this an actual weapon oh my god so it's just like a, a unicorn just completely wacky rainbowy type of weapon going on here yeah i can see this uh easily being in this game here in a way it kind of reminds me of what you would go and expect a color burst weapon to go and look like but yeah dude this is definitely cod mobile material right here when you're down against the last guy and you want to be prepared and oh my god dude there is people out there that do this so this guy has over a thousand bullets of 556 five, and then over a thousand bullets of 762 I have no idea why people do a hardcore looting like this. Like, yeah, don't get me wrong, it's a meme, but people actually do this. The biggest mistakes that people do when it comes to the battle royale for this game is just over loot. You don't really have to have a thousand rounds of one weapon. Find the differences, okay? We have uh, just a guy going into the boss fight. <laughs> then, wait, what is this? Is this the same teleportion going into the nether? If so, that is so funny but hey man you gotta love it hey who knows maybe we could be getting a minecraft dlc potentially in cod mobile this is gambling okay and it's just the holiday draw this is mega gambling <laughs> that it's the dlq 33 holidays yeah man it's pretty crazy what they did with this whole dlq 33 holidays like dude christmas is supposed to be the time of giving you know you're supposed to go and give but uh, COD Mobile, they're, they're not about that. When it comes to buying one of these holiday crates, it doesn't cost $1, it doesn't cost 2 it costs $3 per crate if you want to go and get this dlq 33 you could spend upwards up to 300 dollars trying to go and obtain this which is just so crazy to me when you're playing cod mobile in school and you still hear gunshots <laughs> Oh God, after the match. Okay, I probably should not have uh, have laughed at that. Um, <clears throat> well, this is, uh, this is a deep topic to go into, but uh, let's continue on. Odds of flipping heads or tails, 50%, getting an enchanted bow from fishing, a 0.8% chance, getting a knife from a CSGO case, a 25% chance. Okay, I know where this is going. Getting <laughs> a legendary in COD Mobile. Oh my God. A point zero 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 yeah one percent chance okay yeah we get it dude i feel like this is true and hey to everyone who is spending hundreds of dollars with this you know i i wish you guys the best of luck like to be fair you do you i know cod mobile it's supposed to be a game people can go and spend how much ever money they want to go into this game like hey it's not my money it's your guys's money and if you're getting enjoyment from this then hey dude like don't let anyone go and tell you differently here but yeah the odds really do be like that when cod launches a double xp event and, and you're already maxed out dude prestiging please make this in the game already so many people who i've been talking to on my live stream they've just been like parker we're already at 150 level when are they gonna go and add prestige and dude i have no idea as well but hopefully during season three here at least we can go and see some type of prestiging model even if it is just only prestige one at this moment in time i would be perfectly fine with that i just want to continue leveling up my account here you're the last man standing finish it people and spectate me and then get ready everyone <laughs> he's about to do something stupid oh dude i remember so many search and destroy moments like this isn't only in regards to cod mobile here like this can also relate to just call of duty in general just so many times when you know you're in a 1v3 situation and hey you're maybe you're able to go and kill two people but then yeah you just go and die by the stupidest thing in the game just in a 1v1 situation and you know those people 
spectating you even though you were able to go and kill two enemies and they're just like dude what are you doing you're so trash and just inside you're just like what is wrong with you everyone in the pre-match <laughs> be like dude especially with the new emotes that we're having in this game like people are doing those wind up christmas trees you know summoning presents doing dabs like shooting me especially when i'm doing my multiplayer warm-ups on park of the slayer live which guys by the way i won't be live today which is going to be christmas day i should be live on thursday on that channel but yeah since today is christmas i won't be live just an fyi but it's so funny because i only invite subscribers to uh, my multiplayer warm-up games and dude that's always the case people want to go and show off their new emotes right in front of me and i'm like yeah okay yeah yeah i i get it i get it when pubg mobile players try cod mobile for, <laughs> for the first time oh my god this is so funny dude that is probably the worst spot to be laying down you're completely out in the open if this guy okay you know i can actually see this being like a pubg mobile player he's trying to be all strategic and he's like yeah this spot is really good i'm just gonna be prone right here Th this is so perfect but dude for all you cod mobile players out there you guys know how expensive that this guy is me and the boys during pre-match and oh yeah celebration oh baby yoda yo baby yoda what's going on me and the boys after <laughs> losing from one point yeah everyone is just in a in a depressed state there baby yoda now just full-on old yoda just like kill me now and then oh yeah dude sad keanu going on it, it truly be like that you know you're, you're starting off the match you're feeling good you're feeling on top of the world and then when you all lose it's just like well i i guess gg boys we, we tried our best but uh when you try your best but you don't succeed how the last two br survivors face off guy who killed 10 people to be <laughs> the final two and, the <laughs> and then me who hid in a bush yeah dude hey i'm the uh i'm the bane in this situation by the way dude i feel like that's the only way to go and play br i know some people play like who, who what's the name of this guy pink guy i know a lot of people out there play like him they have zero kills they just constantly loot all the time and they get stacked up with gear and then you know when it comes to someone like me yeah man you're probably gonna go and lose this gunfight here oh my god what is this meme gonna be okay kid proning in a building his acog the dlq 33 and then me poking my arm out from, from across the map okay dude i think this might be the meme of the video here but ladies and gentlemen i think with that said we might as well go and end it on a high note right here if you guys did enjoy this video be sure to go and smack a like on it as well as if you guys are new be sure to go and subscribe for future call of duty mobile videos we need 3,000 likes on this video in order to go and get episode 5. But with that said, my name is Parker. Hopefully you guys are having a wonderful and fabulous day because I certainly am. And I guess I'll talk to you guys within the next video.